Alright guys, today we're going to be playing some auto battles idle. Well, let's get started. First we're going to go in the arena. Get some quick matches in. I only do the arena for the daily because it gives you gems. But doing the arena constantly by itself doesn't really give you much. As you can see, you only get about 100 or or my level, which is uh, 284, I only get about about uh, 4,000 worth of resources, XP, gold, um, training, leaves, and stuff like that. If you lose, you, you get stuff as well, but it's usually not enough. Like, you would probably have to idle this all day, which is not something that I want to do. To like get like a level or two um so i just do this stuff to finish my dailies and then i log off uh i don't think it's a race to the top it's more like a walk through the park to the top you'll never be the like top 10 top 100 probably even like top 500 in this game um unless you pay Unless you're spending thousands of dollars, which I do not plan on doing. But, I will say that... Oh, look, Lazy Bait. And my my uh, guild in this game is called Lazy Boys. Lazy B-O-I-S. Um, but that was a cool little name to run into. Um, but yeah, I play this game because I would have probably quit um like a week or two into it but then i made a guild and uh i feel like i'm too far in to turn back now <laughs> which is why i log in every day i've logged in every single day and i get my dailies done um but i try not to put too much time into it because i realize that all that truly matters in this game is just Logging in for a couple minutes and, you know, getting your dailies done. Attacking the guild boss, right? And then if there's a guild raid, you do the raid. Let me show you that. Me and one other uh, member in the guild has been working on that. Oh, and looks like three of... Well, okay, a bunch of us has been uh, raiding this... Um, and what raids are in this game is, as you can see right here, you can challenge uh, other um, guilds. It's not real time and they don't know you're challenging them, but, you know, um, you can still, you know, challenge guilds. And you can, uh, you can accept the fight from there. You can accept the fight from here and it'll let you refresh to, like, uh, choose new guilds to fight as much as you want. You can accept it from here or... You can go, um, your, the guild rankings, as you can see the other, the, uh, top guilds, the, the, the first day thing, I think this means, like, it's the first day of the season, because there is a new season that everybody is on, um, and yeah, I clicked on this tab right here, that shows my guild, as you can see, there's my name, that's actually a, uh, uh, an Ethereum token that I took the name of. I made the, the the account as a meme, you know, but uh, yeah, ig ignore that. And here's my guild, Lazy Boys, and we are current. We are hovering around 200, 195 ish to like to like 210, so 207. Um, we're around there, so I would say this is where we're meant to be. And uh, here are my guild mates for now. I kicked like four, I kicked like four people who haven't logged on in like a week. Now, I don't, I don't care if like, you know, you take a week or two week off or even a month off or like a month and a half off. It just, like at the start, um, I want to have, you know, just a group of people who are on the same track of just logging in every now and then and doing their dailies. And, you know, it's important to, you know, uh, um, level up the guild resources, uh, 
so that we can gain more rewards, but it's I'm usually just kicking the lower levels that haven't like done much fighting or participated in any guild activities whatsoever. And as you can see here, you can set a message for your for your guild. Um yeah, this game this game is something else I tell you. The only reason I'm still playing it is because I'm the guild leader. Uh, but, uh, yeah, so I started in season 30, and, uh, I just started leveling up. I maybe spent about 20 bucks on this game, maybe like 20 to 30, I don't really remember. 20 to 40 dollars? I want to say around like 25 to 30 dollars. Um, but that's about it. And that was, I spent it on the uh where can i find it is it here yeah i spent I, I bought one deluxe monthly pass and that was it i didn't get the monthly pass just the deluxe monthly i logged in every day and got you know all of the uh six thousand diamonds um and then i think i bought like one weekly deal for 90 diamonds or maybe it was this one or it could have been like this one one of these but i honestly did not spend much um and you don't have to spend anything at all but it does it does help and also knowing how to really maximize your diamonds help as well say for example when you have uh all of the like a good set of characters, right? Like these are all meta characters besides Buddy. He's the weakest link here, I I, I would say, and I can't wait to replace him. <laughs> Uncle Sam, meta. Blood Mary, meta. Alpha, meta. Aphrodite, the newest uh, um, character, meta. Hella strong. Um, and I got most of this gear just from logging in every day. I got all of the gear just from logging in, doing my dailies, um, and you can see my rating on the P on the uh, PVP leaderboard. That's my um, MMR, I guess you could say. My win loss that doesn't really matter, and like I I I I've seen people who have spent more than I have, and they've probably got like 50 games total, 50 matches total, and they're around my rank. <laughs> So yeah, pay to win 100%. Um, but uh, I, this is like a little nice little uh, side game. And there's like no lore. Um, it's just about doing your dailies and playing every day and every single you know week and month and just gradually getting stronger. Um, and I did feel like it helped me a bit as a person. Because it reminds, here's a here's a guild event as well that uh, you can you can do. Um, this is how much dungeon levels of this event that my guild has completed in total. You can see right here, out of 15 members, we completed nearly 1,000. But yeah, back to what I was saying, it helped me as a person because it reminded me. By the way, very gorgeous uh, scenery. It reminded me that as long as you're consistent in life right you're going to level up no matter what just stay on your path and you're going to be where you want to be so this is what the game reminded me of something that you know i've kind of been forgetting and i've appreciated the little life lesson that i got from it so i continue to log in and you know do my dailies that's pretty much all it is, you can, here's the summoning shop, as you can see, Aphrodite. And you got Cupid and Artemis. Usually you want to um, summon from here because this is the newest heroes that you can unlock. And then you get uh, 10 summons for 900 diamonds. Always do this, never do this. The only re way I would do this is if... I would need to roll one more to get um, 
a guaranteed S. That's the only reason I would do that. You know, because you're just... You want to know what's next. You want to know what you get. So, you know, it's it's okay to take the little L for a bit. Hey, I mean, is is it really an L? You're, you're getting your guaranteed S. So if there's like one more roll and you're short 900, like hella short 900, I'm talking you get like 99, then just get one more diamond and do the summon one. And then uh, you're going to get like a bunch of fodder units as well who you can auto fill. And that autofill is going to give you um, experience to level up your characters. And then here you can merge several characters. So you can only merge uh, the same unit. So Deadeye is a ranger. Um, so you can use four other rangers to get him to A+. And then as you can see, I already have an A+, Deadeye. And an A+, can use um a units as fodder to get to rank s and then from rank s to s plus and then s plus is i think it's ss then ss plus and then from ss plus it's sss and then sss plus maybe to um four digit s which is the final um uh level grade so yeah and you can only use like warrior warrior ranger mage and mage you can only use a mage to uh rank up um these two units only a ranger for alpha and only knights for buddy and uncle sam like right here i have atlas i can only use berserker and jacob who are knights who are warriors i can't use uh artemis like what's a better example i guess yeah like the a you can you can only use rangers so yeah you you know use characters to level up other characters um and here you can see a, the entire catalog alpha was the previous unit it was insane insanely good you can see their abilities right here there's their stats she's really cool a really nice passive Uncle Sam, I love Uncle Sam. I want Hercules so I can replace Buddy, who's right here. Easter Bunny is also pretty nice, but he's not metal like Alpha. Kronos is also really, really insane. I could replace uh, um, Buddy with Kronos. Constant, never really seen him. Chocotair, uh, Santa. Pretty, pretty solid unit, but yeah, we're not talking about this right now, but it's a, it's an interesting game to try out. Definitely realize it is pay to win, time gated, and something we're just logging in every day and, you know, doing your dailies. Let me show you the dailies. I don't know if I've shown this before yet, but yeah, win 50 arena battles, and then you'll have to win another 50 for like, 20 more diamonds so here you get 10 then you get uh, 20 from champions attitude uh three so that's gonna bring us to 30 and then the first champions attitude which is i think 25 wins you get uh five diamonds so uh, 35 diamonds from the champions attitude just from winning arena matches in total so it's 125 arena matches that you have to win that's quite a lot it's quite a lot um and then here you can this this one's called roll the dice for forge any three items so you can go here here um let me get a cheap item i like to buy cheap stuff right and then uh where is it here it is for forge click on the cheap wooden stake right we don't have any vampires in here you can use diamonds never use diamonds just gold you can use diamonds or gold to reforge your item and what reforging is you can see right here on my ultimate gear i have um plus eight on it that's basically what reforging is it's giving it a little like a like an extra extra up extra damage kind of thing so like we can see right here plus five 
boom, and it got a little extra damage. And the max, I just hit a plus 14. Also, never spam this because you might hit like plus 14, which is really good, or plus 12. And on more expensive gear, it's it's a lot. This is 101 billion to reload. To, not to reload, but to reforge. So yeah, you can like continue spamming this, right? And then eventually you're going to land on max, which is plus 15. But uh, yeah, don't spam it with your uh, good gear or you're going to go broken. That's not fun. But yeah, all you have to do is reforge three times. You don't have to spam it like I did. I was just, you know, showing you, um, you know, what max is. And after you hit max, you can't uh, upgrade it. And we can even look at the oh let me show you the rankings by the way so i'm currently here 1200 uh something right and i would say this is like the dirt league right and then i would say this is like iron bronze silver gold platinum and then you got like diamond or masters right this is nothing I will never get here, or here, or here, or here, honestly. Like, I'll probably cap out right here. <laughs> Maybe. Um, keep in mind, only, like, how many people are ahead of me in ranking? So, yeah, only 2,200 people are ahead of me. So, keep in mind, all the other, you know, rankings that are there... We got, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven different rankings for 2,000 people. So just keep that in mind. And yeah, this is how far I've come from 8,000 in season 30 to 2,600. Where I am currently 2,200. And I only spent like 30 bucks. I'm not going to spend any more money. I was just testing the game out. Didn't think I would... Uh, be playing it but let me show you let me not waste any more time and show you uh the, the currently the strongest i, will, I don't want to say the strongest but um the highest no he's not she, she's not even a or ghost probably a guy not even the highest level damn you got a 600 right here but let me show you the rank one and this is you can see their lineage basically so yeah they started season 10 so right off the bat they were just going going hard and that's that's their gear as you can see they have chronos i don't have chronos you saw my uncle sam you saw my blood mary my alpha and my aphrodite so yeah these are meta units and if you ever want to know who's good just look at what the highest players are using and yeah i really would love a chronos because apparently he's freaking amazing apparently and we can see what someone else is rolling, right? They got a, a Remus, Grey Worm. I, I mean, I mean, I don't know, but hey, they're here and I'm not. They're here and I'm not. But honestly, what truly matters apart from units is just your uh, gear, your gear and the level. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this game. I'm definitely no master at it. Uh, I'm just some guy that logs in a couple of minutes a day and completes his dailies. This is actually a test um, recording for for some other videos on um, other games, other Android games that I wanna that I wanna play and review. Um, but I'm not much of a reviewer, so I'll probably just be talking over them like this. Anyway, if you uh, enjoyed the video, have one on me and get yourself a glass of water and stay hydrated. Thank you for watching.